don't feel like you're going to be done playing college football, but um, obviously after this week, you'll be done playing in the booth. Um, I'm looking forward to it, though. Obviously, the biggest game is the last game for us. So, or Our biggest game of the year so far will be this game. So I'm looking forward to it. Fans will show out senior day. Uh, it'll be fun. Yeah. What are you seeing for the Kansas State's defense that sticks out to you? They just play really hard. Like, tenacity. Like, they're after the ball every play. Um, they, they'll try to keep everything in front of them. Kind of not look, like, don't don't want to give up, like, a deep ball or something. But that's how they play everyone, I feel like. So, I mean, we, we should be ready for the challenge. We got to match their tempo or even exceed it. So, we'll be ready. Over the last two years, what's your favorite memory at the stadium? <sighs> Beating Oklahoma. I think, yeah, that has to be the number one. Number 16 in the country at the time. And then bowl game. Um, Bean, obviously, I was happy for Bean. Uh, but, yeah, that has to be my favorite memory. So. How much family are you going to have in attendance? Uh, I have, like, 25 to 30 people coming. So, yeah, including friends, too. I mean, they're all coming out. They got their tickets way before it sold out. So, I mean, I'm looking forward to it. Um, I just love every time they get to come see me play. Like, it's just it's an awesome feeling to sit there. You had a lot of family, a lot of the home games, or is yeah. it really special? They said senior year, they're coming to everything. Like, they don't want to miss anything. The away games are really just with my parents. Mm -hmm. But um, every home game, it's like 10 people, at least 10 family members come through. So, yeah, I love it. What's your family like? Are they loud? Do they get into it? Oh, my God. My brother, oh, yeah, he's loud. He gets loud. And my nephew will get loud, too. He's like six years old. He'll just be screaming my name. But um, I love him. Uh, obviously, it's a lot of support. They love the team. So, I mean, yeah, why not? The play where Armage got to go in motion last week and then just depleted the, the <laughs> defender. What was that like in the, line, the offensive line room when you guys were watching tape? He's been waiting to do that for so long. Uh, you remember how Coach K was like, we well, draw up our own plays. That was like, he he did, he came up with that so fast because he seen uh, Trent Williams do it, and he. Uh, I mean, we were excited. We knew it. We knew he could do that. Just like how big he is and how how the way he moves. Um, I mean, I'm blocking down and I just hear the stadium, like, ooh, and like, it was like a four yard gain. So I'm like, it had to be him. So I was just like, hey. And then you watch it on film, and it was just like, it was like, wow, it's crazy. You obviously got the, the senior bowl invite. What was it like to hear him say that, you know, you got invited to that? Um, it was definitely, it was pretty cool. Um, got the Shrine Bowl first, and then like, it was like two days later, they're like, all right, senior bowl is coming too. And I was just, I mean, you drink, it's like when I was growing up, I always watched the senior bowl, like one-on-ones or something like, you know, not like the fact that I'm going to be there, like in Mobile, like it's crazy. It's surreal, but it's things you dream of as a kid. And um, if you work hard enough, I mean, it's crazy. The hard work pays off. And it's like, it's just cool to see it. So that's, you know. yeah. Was this something your brother did? No, my brother, so coming from Central Missouri, it's hard to, it's harder to get opportunities. But um, he went to the Gridiron Showcase, I think. And uh, no, he didn't go to the senior bowl. Thanksgiving's next week. What's the uh, favorite dish that you get for Thanksgiving? My favorite thing, have you ever, this is weird. You ever had crescent rolls? Uh, like Absolutely. the, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah oh, yeah. those are like, I'll okay. destroy like 20 of those. Yeah. Like the Pillsbury Doughboy yeah. ones. And then yeah. mashed potatoes, those are probably my two. Mm -hmm. Those two. Yeah. What sticks out about K-State on defense? I was saying uh, the way they play, or how their tenacity, like how hard they play. I think that's just a brand of their culture. Um, if you look at their O-line and D-line, they just, they play hard. And uh, you got to respect it, but you got to match it at the same time. So it's going to be a good challenge. With this being the final game at the booth, I mean, you played a lot of games here. Uh, how special is it going to be playing in the booth before they tear it down for the last time? Oh, man, that, I didn't even think about that, actually. That's crazy. Um, I, it feels good knowing that we started something here um, and we're leaving it in good hands. Uh, I mean, it's, I can't wait till like, two or three years come back and just see a whole new booth. It's going to be crazy. I look forward to it, though. I know they're going to kill it even after the seniors leave, but um, we got to handle business Saturday. So. Cole's a guy that's obviously a lot younger than you. Yeah. What what sets you most about what he was able to do his on Saturday? His composure. It's crazy. I mean, obviously his dad, you know, being a GM and everything. Um, I think he's been around big games, big time football. So he, he's very used to it. He looked like it was just like another day for him. He came out in the offense uh, in the huddle. He was loud. He was, he was leading us. And um, we knew that coming through practice. Um, he, he did the same thing out of practice. Um, so as soon as uh, Bean unfortunately went down, I mean, we're confident in 15 to come out there. So, and it's pretty cool. I mean, that, that's also every other kid's dream, like as a true freshman coming up there. I mean, he let us down there in the two minutes, so it's cool. But yeah, we love Cole.